Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Congratulations, Jeff, on your win. Thank you. Um, I understand that you've been nominated twice before for the Seabiscuit sea and the Contender. Mm -hmm. So, and you mentioned on stage that the actor is pretty heavy. Very so can heavy. You, can you describe a little what it feels like to hold him? Well, if you have rotator cuff problems like I do, it's a, it's tough. It's things like I just somebody told me it's, it's 14 pounds, you know. So it's pretty heavy, but it's a, it's a wonderful uh, weight as well. It's good. Hey, Jeff, over here. Hi. Congratulations hey. on your win. Thank you. Um, <clears throat> last night, Hollywood uh, held a telethon to try to raise more money mm -hmm. for the victims of, of Haiti and their earthquake. Um, so much was raised, over $58 million. I, wow. Um, do you, you think any more can be done from Hollywood? So much has been done. Oh, already. yeah. Hollywood always steps up in times of uh, crisis, you know. Uh, I was uh, kind of upset, but also uh, very happy about trying to make a call last night, and the phones were all just jamming. You couldn't get through, you know. But finally, we did, and uh, it was uh, it was wonderful to uh, you know, make a contribution, and especially, you know, uh, with uh, George and all, all my uh, fellow actors doing such a great job. You know, I'm really uh, proud to be a part of that that group. Hello, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, um, you are the uh, father of, of three adult daughters. Uh, so tell me a little bit about uh, living in the, uh, you and your wife living in an empty nest, and also what are some things that you and, and she did right in raising daughters? <laughs> you, you, you must have a few daughters, huh? <laughs> yeah. Um, I always heard it was tougher raising the girls than boys, but being a boy myself, I don't know about that. My wife, uh, she did such a wonderful job raising the girls. I, I pitched in as much as I could, but uh, like my dad, I was, you know, gone uh, for a lot of the time. Uh, but uh, I love my girls very much, and uh, my wife, um, you know, has uh, you know, raised some uh, beautiful. Uh, Sue, why don't you come out here for a second? Come on, because this might be a good, you can answer some of these questions. Ladies and gentlemen, Sue Bridges. She's asking the question is about raising uh, daughters and how did you raise such a beautiful daughters and what did you do? And I said, you know, that you, you were there most of the time. I was, you know, did my bit, but I uh, blame you for their uh, being such wonderful people. Oh, thank you. Well, he was fun and I was constant. <laughs> oh, very well. Very good. Very good. Yeah. And uh, but they're they're, they're still uh, they come around all the time. I mean, they really uh, they consider Sue their best friend. I think you know, call her all the time. In fact, I want my time. phone back. Oh, you've got to you've got to call. I'm sure them. we have uh, texts and stuff. Texts. Oh, my wife is te uh, is a text expert. I've learned how to text. I'm very excited. I'm very high tech now. And as far as being a an empty a nest and all that. It's not that uh, empty, you know. Uh, for one thing, the girls uh, come around a lot. They like hanging out uh, with us and that being home. And also, uh, my wife moved from uh, uh, humans to dogs. Now she raises dogs with the same intensity that she raised our daughters. Almost the same. Well, you're gone a lot. You keep me company. That's right. That's right. Uh, I have. Uh, I don't. I don't raise them. You know, like. <laughs> whelp them or anything, but I, uh, we have a Yorkie and a uh, Rhodesian Ridgeback. Two very, Jeff. I call them the special needs kids. Hi. Congratulations to both of you. Now, wait a minute. How did he end up with the phone in the pocket? Because it doesn't fit in the purse. Because it doesn't of fit in the purse. I mean, look at this purse. I put the phone. I couldn't get the phone and the glasses in, so, <laughs> at the same time. So. Hey, I, Jeff, is there a lipstick you. in that pocket, too? No, lipsticks in and here. <laughs> hey, I want to know what it's like. Jeff's such a cool guy. What's it like getting dressed for a day like today with him? Is, does he get nervous? Does he get antsy? Does he? Oh, he had a massage. I had like the troops in to you know, everything. <laughs> and he's out having a massage. Um, he's very, he's pretty cool about everything. I tend, I tend to get a touch of narcolepsy at moments like this. It's, it's okay. Funny. <laughs> 
Hey, but in a personal way, what, what does this mean to you to, to be standing up there tonight? Well, you know, like I was saying, it, to be acknowledged by your fellow actors, by the guys who do what you do, you know, and uh, know, the guys who know what it's all about, that's, uh, that's quite an acknowledgement, and it just it feels just wonderful. Really, really amazing. And also, I, I felt my mom and dad, you know, they, uh, we lost my mom last year and my dad years before that, but I felt them, their spirits, you know, rushing in the room, you know, applauding and, you know, they would loving love this. this moment. They would be really happy. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you so much.